Hi everyone, I am Angeline Marcadejas from the Marketing Department of NCAS Soft Dev Incorporated, and I am here to talk to you about Workmate. Workmate is a three-in-one productivity software that can be used by your work from home or off-site employees. You see, back in 2019, when telecommuting law was passed, the Employers' Confederation of the Philippines conducted a survey that resulted to 87% of respondents being open to implementing a work-from-home scheme. However, the lack of a software for monitoring working hours and output was one of the major reasons that made employers very reluctant. Little did we know that a year later, the pandemic coerced us to participate in the world's biggest remote working experiment. Now we realized that work from home program can benefit both employers and employees and that this will be a part of the new normal. But employers need not worry because the software sought out before is now here with Workmate. But Workmates can also be used by office or site employees if high productivity is the aim of your company. Based on statistics, the major reasons for low productivity is due to a. Distractions, especially with social media, computer and mobile games, and a lot more. b. Lack of time management and organizational skills. and c. Believe it or not, affected employees. Do you know that one bad apple can affect others to slack off too? With Workmate, everyone will be pulling their weight and employees will appreciate the use of Workmate. As mentioned earlier, Workmate has three main features. Firstly, it is a time tracking and remote monitoring software. Also, it is a collaboration or project management tool. And lastly, Workmate is a planner. As a time tracking and remote monitoring software, it reduces distraction and enhances time management and organizational skills of employees. For employers, this can be a daily time recorder, a tool to monitor productivity and to know how time is spent. System-generated reports such as DTR, Accomplishment and Work Analysis Reports, will take the guesswork out of employee performance reviews. So how does Workmate work? First step is to register your employees in our system. You will be asked to enter the user's profile, then go to Settings. Indicate if you want screenshots captured or not. If yes, then enter the interval in minutes. Screenshots can tell you what they are working on and if there is progress. Next is the time allowed for a user to have no keystrokes or mouse clicks before system determines that user is idle. Also. State if you want Workmate to track what website and apps they are using. Finally, you can actually block the websites and apps you do not want used by typing them here in the restricted groups and for monitoring purposes may indicate also the productive websites and apps. So once the user is registered in our system, he can download Workmate app into his computer that will look like this. Now, as far as the employee is concerned, all he has to do to log in and out is to open the app, choose a task, and go about his work like this, for example. User can actually drag this taskbar in and out of the view. User can keep changing tasks by simply clicking another. Here, you may or may not put a comment regarding the finished task, but what you enter here will show in the accomplishment report. Now click save and continue working on the next task. As long as the task is on play, the system records the hours worked, tasks performed, keystrokes made, apps and website used, and captured screenshots. Once you are done for the day or whenever you want to take a break, simply pause the task and close the app. It is that simple. Let me stop here for now because at this point, I would like to introduce to you the next presenter and the president of NCAS Soft Dev Incorporated, Mr. Norman C. Laksamana. Thank you, Angeline, 
and thank you all for being here with us. In the next five minutes, my goal is to convince you that Workmate is best for your company. So let me tell you how Workmate has helped my business and others who have tried it. You see, Workmate is a win-win for both employers and employees. One main reason is employee retention. Employees love the idea of a work from home or a hybrid workplace. It provides a work-life balance since they have more time now to spend with family and personal concerns. Also, it lessens the stress of having to rush to work every day. And finally, they save on the cost of commuting, food, and others. So with a happy employee, employers benefit also from employee retention. The next benefit is you can hire from anywhere in the world. With Workmate, you no longer have to worry if your staff is working and working productively, whether in the office or working remotely. Finally, and in our case, we were able to reduce costs by having a smaller office space. We have closed one of our satellite offices, giving us a lot of savings. And of course, cost reduction due to increased productivity up to 40%. So the question is, how do we know if our employees are really working? Let us start with the daily time recorder. Our system will record the date and the total hours worked. The gray bar will show if he was working straight or flexi hours. You can click the date and show you all the time ins and time outs. Now what are those different bar colors? Green means active, or employee is actively working and doing mouse clicks and keystrokes. It can also mean that employee is physically at his workstation. Orange means idle, or employee has a task on play, but without keystrokes and could be away from his desk. Blue means edited, or employee has manually entered that data, hence not system generated. Now, to analyze productivity, you may want to generate the work analysis report. This will show total hours worked and the hours active, idle, or edited. It will show you all the tasks performed, the time consumed, the target KSPM, and the actual KSPM. KSPM means keystrokes per minute. You may actually indicate the average KSPM per task and then compare it with the actual keystrokes made. The keystrokes made may actually indicate the level of productivity. Then I can choose a task, like this one for example, that will show all the date and time employee worked on the task. I can further click a date to show me details, like the apps and the websites used and the screenshots captured by the system. I can then click screenshot so I can see what employee was working on and if there was progress. So all those data are available for you to analyze. You may not have time to go over them regularly, but it's nice to know that they are available when needed. But wait, there's more. Workmate can also show you all the applications used and websites visited, grouped by productive and then by others. You can check if there are any red flags or apps and websites you may deem unproductive. Then the total time, the target usage, and actual usage. Based on this data, employee performed poorly as part of his job as a marketing person is to use those two software at 23 and 22 percent. However, employee use it only at 9 and 5 percent. Finally, you can also click the app to show you all the tasks performed using that application and then click the task to show you screenshots. So thank you for listening and at this point 
let's pause for a little Q&A before we proceed to the other integrated features of WorkMe. Hi everyone, this is Angeline again. Let me continue by discussing the second feature integrated to WorkMate, which is the collaboration or project management software. Here you can create a project schedule for your team, while the system monitors task assigned and due dates to help you manage your team with ease. Attach files or store documents, write notes for each task or send messages and notices through the system to keep the whole team informed. You can keep communications and project details in one place for easy collaboration and access anytime and anywhere. Allow me to show you a short demonstration. You can create a project schedule by going to your portal and choosing categories and tasks and then add a category. But let me show you a created sample project to keep the demo short. I will click edit to show you how it was created. So in adding a project, you enter the project name, put the date range and assign the project. You can type details, check the users, attach files and check history of who did what and when to this project. Once project is entered, you can save and close and proceed to entering task by clicking add task. Here you can see the created task, the status whether complete, in progress, or new, and who they were assigned to. Now let us check the first task. To enter a task, of course you give it a task name and assign it to a user. Very important is to give it a schedule so you can monitor if task is due. An option here is to enter the estimated keystroke per minute. By doing so, system can track if user is productive or not. You can attach files like this so that stakeholders will have needed documents handy and not to be bothering anyone or spending time looking for it. Another great feature is the discussion board. You can write comments, queries, replies, or instructions and record all of them if needed to be reviewed. Comments entered here will automatically go to recipient's email. Furthermore, you can have a scrum or task board view and export a Gantt chart. So everything you need to manage a project is here with WorkMate. To discuss the third feature and to end our presentation, allow me to bring back Mr. Norman C. Laksamana. Thanks again, Angeline. The third integrated feature is the planner. So WorkMate has a built-in calendar and a to-do list. Now let me do a quick walkthrough of WorkMate now we'll discuss the planner feature and a recap of what we have discussed already. So here is the dashboard. And as you can see, you have here the calendar. So what goes in the calendar? All the project tasks that we have discussed earlier that you have given a date range will go to the calendar. Also, all permanent or miscellaneous tasks that you have assigned yourself and given a schedule will go to the calendar, like this. You can give it a single date or a recurring date and save it. Another great system to plan your day is by having a to-do list. Here, you can add a task, give it a date, a name or a title, and maybe a description. All right, your to-do list view can be either by date or show all that you haven't done yet. And you can actually click and drag your task. So if you want to organize it by priority, all right, and again, to help you do the planning. You can go here to check your day, your week or month, and see the total hours you have worked already and the tasks you have performed and other details. 
and you can check my team to see who are actually online and working. Now to recap, here is where you go to do settings for your company, your employees, your restricted websites and apps, and those productive websites and apps. You can go to categories and tasks to enter all your project, your permanent and miscellaneous tasks. Go to manage in and out if you want to do a manual entry. And reports to generate your DTR, your accomplishment report, and your work analysis report. So that's it for now. Thank you so much for listening. We hope that Workmate can be an essential tool for your company as it has been for others. Let me give you to our business development officer for more Q&A. And again, thank you so much and have a nice day.